Chris Tapps Porzingis speaks on how grateful he is to be back on the floor for the Celtics. Check out the video. Uh, honestly, I felt uh, better than I expected. Um, but, I mean, obviously, the first win is, is, is pretty crazy. You know, lungs burning, legs burning, everything. But uh, after that, um, it was decent. And uh, just the normal, no? Like, even on the couple of lobs, like, JB threw me a lob, Peyton threw me a lob. Like, both of them, I had, like, flat tired, like crazy. Like, didn't get up at all. Um, but, yeah, it was, it was good to be back out there. And, and uh, what was the other part you said? Just what did, what did you see in terms of watching the team? Obviously, they've been off to a great start. But where did you see areas where you could maybe yeah, no. things go even to another? No, point? of course. The obvious, no. Like, um, obviously, when we play with, like, uh, say, Nimi, uh, he's more in a dunker, you know? So, obviously, when I'm out there, I can create more space, you know? This is, like, the obvious stuff. And, and um, and uh, yeah, but to, overall, just, yeah, my shooting ability to create more space, Rim protection. I wanted to bring that, you know, and, and make sure we're like a, uh, at a good level there, and um, and honestly, just play my game. You know, these guys were like looking looking for me early, just trying to get me going, as they always are, and um, yeah, just grateful to be back out there. Throw that one. Yeah. The, the Jalen one, I saw it like from a mile away, and I was like, okay, boom, he's gonna throw it for sure. I pointed a little bit to give him the confidence, like it's there. And then as he threw it, like, that one was not as flat as the Peyton one. The Peyton one was crazy. Like, I don't even know how I got it over the rim. And that one, I was, as I was running back, I was like, Phew. like, shaking my head and stuff. But, uh, but it's, like, part of the process, you know? like, especially first game back. It's a little bit, like, timing on the jump, catching a flat tire maybe here and there and stuff. It's normal. So I would say, like, it was one of the easiest rehabs for me. Uh, the only thing was that I had to stay off the, the ankle for, was it four or six weeks? So it was tough, you know, it's just on one leg with the scooter, like, can't get up the stairs, like, it was, you know, so it was a little bit difficult from that perspective, but once that moment passed and I was able to walk, it was, honestly, felt pretty natural. Just when I was playing that game five, that's when, like, it didn't feel natural, like, you know, you feel something is off. But uh, once, once, uh, once uh, Dr. O'Malley fixed it, honestly, it felt supernatural and just needed time to heal and, and get stronger. And, and uh, I would say it was one of my easiest like rehabs. Great, obviously, it uh, was a pretty, not super long, but it was a long rehab. And uh, I was itching to get back out there with, uh, with, uh, with this team after winning a championship, you know? And uh, uh, yeah, it was a good beginning. Good first game back. Can you explain the process? There we go. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video, Hoop Life Family.